Depending on your use case, this low cost or even no cost Wi-Fi hack has the potential of being better than a fully installed van Wi-Fi system. So we've all been there of course, outside the van the signal's fine, you've got a data package and yet you're getting your 4G down, come inside the van, shut the door and the signal drops right away and you're struggling and it's of course you're in a metal box, the signal's bouncing away. Uh, if you're on a hookup of course you've got an earth leader, you're almost like a Faraday cage, you, okay you've got a lot of glass around so it's not quite a Faraday cage but you ain't getting a good signal. Now there's some really good MiFi bits of kit around and if you've are sort of got a television with a smart TV or if you want to tether your iPad or anything along those lines, um, worth getting, um, you get an external aerial, or brings the signal from outside, brings it in. You do of course need to go outside and in some areas you have got it, but when you do that kit will bring it in and you'll get a good reception. But for someone like me, I can't really justify that kit and I suspect there's other people out there like me because I don't have a television, I don't have my head in social media all, all the time. But sometimes I do want to get online because I want to perhaps check a message or look at a map to see where I'm going the next day or maybe book a campsite or, or any along those lines. It's not a great deal of use to justify you know, all the kit, but I'm struggling and I'm waving the phone near the window or, or hanging over the, into the cab where I've got the big sort of windscreen to try and get a signal coming through. Well, if you've been doing that, uh, this little hack may uh, solve that for you, be sufficient for your data needs and actually have one up on the full spec installed MiFi kit. And quite simply, you may have the solution ligging around in your drawer for no cost at home, or if you haven't the cheapest chip on eBay, and that is an old phone. Get a second phone and put a cheap data sim in there. And then what I do is I quite simply tether my main phone to the second phone which I park by the windscreen so it's got a good signal coming in. So the, the, the second phone's picking up signal and then I can let my leisure walk around the van hooking into that one. Fantastic. And as I said in some cases this solution will be better than a full set MiFi. Why is that? Well I keep the basic apps on the second phone and I have a different SIM in there, a different network SIM. So if there's no signal on my main phone outside the van, then I can't make calls. Well, maybe there's a signal on the second phone. So what I'll do is I'll just swap them over. Okay, so now I'm using my secondary phone as my work kit and uh, my main phone is the receptor bringing in the signal. So very, very simple solution. If you can't justify the big kit, no cost or low cost MiFi solution. <laughs>